How are you guys? Today we'll see how we can create this easy star rating uh, in pure CSS and JavaScript. As you can see, when I'm clicking on a stars, it displays even the number of the star which are, uh, I'm using. Okay, here we are in the Visual Studio Code. And uh, actually for the rating, uh, this is the CSS uh, style. Afterwards, we have uh, the markup, HTML markup, and the JavaScript. Let's start with the construction of our uh, script. So we have uh, one unordered list and we are using uh, certain CSS rules in order to create our rating. So we are using uh, this uh, before rule and we are setting up our star how it will look like. It's a full star. For all the stars which are not having this property active, we are setting the empty star by modifying the content property. This means that uh, all those stars after this rule, so three, four and five, will have uh, an empty star displayed. And afterwards, the following two rules, they work together. So while we are hovering on a certain star, we do the same. All the stars before this star, we're setting up them uh, with a full star and uh, the others we are making empty. So this is a quite interesting feature of CSS. So uh, this the makeup. Uh, we have uh, data rate also a property for each of the stars. So we can uh, use later uh, this property to send requests. Uh, to backend server and first uh, we grab our container here uh, it's the ul and also each of the items we're having them into items array and then we uh, have uh, one little event listener we're just capturing the click event when we have the event we are saving the class of the current element we are clicking on so if it's not active we are setting up the class to active, right? So we're just moving this uh, additional uh, class uh, over uh, the items. And uh, in between, before doing this, we need to um, clear the previous active class. So uh, for all the other items, we are using the remove uh, method of uh, class list. So we are clearing up the star and we are setting the star uh, on another position. That's basically how this uh, script works. It's uh, pretty simple. And uh, here, just for uh, debugging purposes, we are displaying the attribute uh, data rate. And that's what we saw in the console. Actually, if we click on a star, this is its uh, data rate uh, property here. All right, so that's it, guys. I hope you enjoyed uh, this uh, information and if you like the tutorial, you can subscribe to the channel.